welcome to the science class my dear students today we are going to focus sense organ of touch so first let's answer this question what sense organ do we use to touch the objects around us yes that's right we use our skin to touch the objects around us the skin is the organ responsible for the sense of touch did you know the skin is the largest organ of our body dear students your skin is very important it covers and protects everything inside your body the skin stops germs and harmful chemicals getting into the body and also provides protection against sunlight it also prevents the loss of water from the body so it is one of the most important jobs our skin does is to keep the water inside our body just like the rain coat keeps us dry when it's raining our skin keeps the water inside our bodies from escaping the skin is divided into three layers the epidermis the dermis and the hypodermis let's discuss them one by one the first one is epidermis the layer on the outside is called the epidermis the epidermis is the part of your skin you can see let's see what does the epidermis do the epidermis is thin and acts as a protective barrier against the external environment the epidermis keeps bacteria and germs from entering your body and blood stream and causing infections it also protects against rain sun and other elements the epidermis continually makes new skin cells these new cells replace the approximately 40000 old skin cells that your body sheds every day The epidermis also provides skin its color. The epidermis contains melanin, the pigment that gives skin its color. The darker your skin is, the more melanin you have. When you go out into the sun, these cells make extra melanin to protect you from getting burned by the sun's ultraviolet rays. The next layer down is the dermis. You cannot see your dermis because it's hidden under your dermis. So, let's see what does the dermis do. The dermis makes up 90% of skin's thickness. The dermis has collagen and elastin. Collagen is a protein that makes skin cells strong. Another protein found in the dermis, elastin, keeps skin flexible. It also helps stretch skin regain its shape. Sweat glands in the dermis release sweat through skin pores. Sweat helps regulate your body temperature. The dermis also provides blood supplies. Blood vessels in the dermis provide nutrients to the epidermis, keeping the skin layers healthy. The last one is hypodermis, the innermost layer of the skin. So, its main function is to regulate body temperature. Fat in the hypodermis keeps you from getting too cold or hot. Hair growth happens in this layer of our skin. The nerve endings in your hypodermis tell you how things feel when you touch them. they work with your brain and nervous system so that your brain gets the message about what you are touching dear students as you can see the skin is a very important organ and for this reason we should take care of it there are three basic tips number 1 wash your hands before meals when you get back home from the park or school The second one is don't forget to cover scraps and cut with bandages. This keeps the dirt out and helps prevent infections. Number third one is protect your skin from harmful ultraviolet rays 
by applying sunscreen thank you my dear students i hope you enjoyed the lecture so this is all about the sense organ of touch subscribe the channel for more learning videos thank you